What are some of the myths of education that you have to overcome for them to, you know, be more open to what you're up to? That a child needs to be explicitly instructed in something in order to learn it. Even really breaking down that whole teacher-learner construct is something that, you know, can be helpful for people and, and, and showing and explaining maybe or even exemplifying that learning is a very internal and an intrinsic process for people. Yeah, giving examples, I think, or, or helping people to see when their child or when they themselves have had experiences in their lives where they've learned something that's been on their own terms, in their own way, and the, the different quality of that, I suppose, as opposed to maybe kind of a forced learning experience or a coerced mm -hmm. learning experience. So I think helping people to draw on experiences that they've had themselves and to see those can be helpful. I think the other myth is that mm -hmm. children need to be disciplined all the time mm -hmm. continuously and somehow their, their behavior needs to be controlled or they'll be unbridled and wild. And, and mm -hmm. I, I, I don't know what sort of comes up in people's imagination, but it's a question we get often asked, mm -hmm. how, 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 are, how do we manage discipline, you know? Mm -hmm. um, and I think, again, it just... It's a real lack of understanding of, of freedom and, and, and human nature. And so mm. when human nature, when given freedom, it self-disciplines, it self-regulates, right, it self right. um, Whereas in a system where control is the dominant feature, then that control is, must be evaded or must be in mm. some way um, opposed. And so then you get discipline problems and it becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. So right. I think that's a very strong myth, actually, that needs to be overcome in order to embrace this model. This is the Agentic Schools podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world, where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.